to be on the podium again at the World Championships, second place. Um, thrilled, thrilled to be here. And Eva put down an incredible run, um, and Luca put down an incredible run. So we're all within a second of each other, and I think that's probably the tightest podium we've seen. So it was such a hot final, and I'm stoked to be on the podium. Yeah, yeah, of course I wanted to defend the title, but I mean. Um, you know, pre-Olympic year, the pressure of the Olympic quota, the pressure of Olympic qualification, the pressure of defending the title. I think, you know, I raced really well in that final and 0.4 of a second is all that was missing between uh, second place and first place and, um, you know, I don't know where they were, maybe at the finish line, maybe in the middle section, but to be on the podium again is, um, I, I'm thrilled, I'm thrilled. I mean, there's bonus points available at this race um, for podium, so I'm, yeah, emotional and I'm really happy, really pleased to have put down a performance to earn that spot and um, I guess that's that's why I'm still thrilled with, it, with the podium, you know, obviously to win is, is really special but to be on the podium is still amazing, especially when it's got this value and um, means that I've booked my spot to Tokyo. And tomorrow you have another chance in the C1? Yeah, so tomorrow we've got the C1 semi-final where all three of us Aussie girls are in um, and we'll be fighting to qualify the quota spot first and foremost and, and uh, yeah, looking looking to get out there and paddle freely and, and safely to qualify into the final and, and if that happens then we'll see what happens.